The LWO is in the building. It's time for everyone to stand up and take notice. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, accompanied by Rey Mysterio, representing the LWO from Tala, Jalisco, Mexico, weighing in at 228 pounds, the Dragon Lee! Paying homage to the original founding fathers of the LWO, this is a team that represents our Latino culture openly and proudly. They become a family of sorts, Michael. They win together, they lose together, but they always fight together. Here comes Master Gable. And his opponent, representing the Alpha Academy from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 202 pounds, Chad Gable. Chad may be the greatest coach of all time. Look what he did to Otis. Yeah, but is Chad Gable actually teaching the right lessons? Look at the record book, Saxton. You see all those Ws? Those look like the right lessons to me. Great tag team partner, great mentor, great single star. Chad Gable has not only resurrected his career, but Otis's as well. And Gable does it all for the Academy. Thank you! Thank you! You can see by the look on his face that he came here tonight to send a message. He certainly determined to prove a point. Is it enough? And a shoulder in the air. Still no end in sight here. Down he goes. Right there. Let's go. Do it. Ah, look at this. Just breaking down the opponent. Uh-oh, gonna try to break the leg! Ouch! Leg breaker. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. Mentally, as much as it does physically. They gave him now chains of offense together. Just attack after attack from Gable. the biggest mistake a WWE superstar could make when in the ring with Chad Gable. The worst thing they could do is overlook Gable. Gable may not be as big as other superstars, but he can tie you up in knots and tap you out quickly. You need to treat Gable like the threat he is. Off into the pin. He forces a break before the count of two. He's still in this. Vicious right for him. Look at the arm for a Fujiwara armbar. Ah, uh, Fujiwara armbar applied. Making the arm numb makes your opponent very vulnerable. Taking a trip outside, but he's got to be mindful of the count. <laughs> Drop kick hits hard, lands harder. Oh, look at the oh, twist. And he's taking this to the outside now. And now thrown back into the ring. And he goes for the pin. Get it. 
pushed out into the defensive. Attacks like that are what put Gable at the top of the class. There's some power behind that punch. Take a lot more than that to keep this man down. And his offense with a fuckful purpose. No way. Suicide die! Whatever it takes to win. That's finding any which way to topple the competition. Hurling your own body like that is insane. And a poison pot. The degree of difficulty or something like that can't be overstated. position here. Oh, this is going to be ugly, guys. Oh, Drop it into the barricade. Spine first. Switch. As the arm into a handle lock. Oh. Sue still. Got to find a way back in the ring now. Before the count runs out. Side side on the top rope. Lift off. This one, a count out. The referee's count is more than enough time to get back in the ring. The loser only has themselves to blame. 